Okay, so uh, I picked up one of these, uh, I ordered one of these Wilson Combat uh, grip modules for the uh, SIG P320. Now, this one's a little different than what you're used to seeing. Now, I know everybody has seen these. If, if you own a P320, you've probably seen these. Um, this one's a little different because this one is a 15 round module. Now, if you've been following Wilson Combat, uh, they've been producing their version of the uh, the P320, which they Wilson Combat do make their own guns, but sometimes they take um, like guns from like other manufacturers, like Glock and Sig. They just started doing the Sig sometime last year, which was 2019, and they were sort of put their own touches on it. You know, to make it to make it better than the factory gun, and then they will sell the gun. You know, just you know, with their touches on it. But um, in the midst of doing that, they they Wilson Combat have been making their own version of the P320 frame. Now, with the P320 being a modular gun, you know, the frames are easy to replace. So they've been building and selling. The uh, their version of the uh, P320 frame uh, grip frame, but um, they last year when they started building their guns, they only had the 17 round modules, which the, they had the carry model, which was a 17 round model with the 3.9 inch slide, and then they had the full size model, which was a 17 round with a uh, what was it, four point. 4.7 inch slide so I picked up one of these uh, I, I never bought one because I never I just didn't have a need for another 17 round gun uh, the two that I have are pretty much set you know how they're gonna be so I'm gonna leave them that way I mean sort of like this one here this is my uh, um, carry size um, with the um, polymer 80 polymer 80 grip frame on it and that that's pretty much how that one is going to stay. But uh, I decided to pick up one of these Wilson Combat uh, grip frames. Uh, let's just get into this and see how it's see how it is. Get it installed. Now this is the gun I'll be putting it on. This is um, this is one has the original small frame on it. But uh, I decided to get another frame because I don't you know in case I don't want to use a laser, I just want to use a light sometime. It's easier because this laser, it requires a tool to get that laser off. And I just don't want to, you know, keep taking the screws in and out and then end up stripping out the screws. So I decided to just get an extra frame, which was this one. Now that Wilson Combat has came out with a 15 round uh, grip frame. Uh, let's see how this is going to look on here. Now... Everybody, um, everybody that buy these seem to like them. Every all the P three twenty P three twenty owners that have these, everybody seem to like them. So they say they feel really good in hand. So this one is the uh, compact, uh, no manual safety, and black. Now you can get them with a the manual safety for like the M eighteen or M seventeen, or you can get the Desert Tan. And, of course, you can get uh, other sizes. Now, another size you can get, they do have the X Compact model, which is the, uh, what is it, the 3.6-inch barrel size, the subcompact size slide with the 15-round um, uh, grip. So they do have that on their website if that's the one you want. So it fits the, the X Compact model. So here's the frame here. You got your Wilson Combat um, Starburst or Sunburst pattern or whatever they have. But uh, it says Wilson, you got your Wilson Combat branding right there. So, now it does feel good in the hand though. Feels very good in the hand. So, yeah, that feels really good. I've never, I've never, um, this is my first Wilson Combat frame, so, 
Of course, you got a rail. So this is the compact size. So we're going to try the magazine. Here is my uh, compact size uh, P320 here. 15 round magazine. There you have it. 15 round Wilson combat frame. So let's get it on the gun. Take this gun apart. Empty. And let's see how it's going to look on there. Take out the pin. And this is a good thing about the P320. And pull out the chassis. And there you go. Okay, so. Okay, let's see here. Should just drop right in. Pull back as far as it'll go. Okay, now, holes are not lining up here. And it always happens on camera, you know. Every time I every time I start the video, that's when it happens. So it is a bit tight. Okay, okay. I'm gonna stop the video and see if I can get this freed up. Okay, so <sighs> I did get it in, but I gotta say it was extremely tight. Now. I, when I did get it out, I had to uh, I had to put some gun oil around the inner the inner parts of the frame, so uh, so so it allowed it to uh, slide in a little bit easier. But uh, it's it is this is the tightest uh, grip frame that I've ever seen. Uh, even now, if I wanted to pull this out by hand, I, I mean I couldn't do it. I had to take the pin out. But if I took that pin out. And tried to pull this out hand. I'd have to get something to pry this out. But uh, it, it's going. It is going to stay on here for a while. But uh, getting it in for the first time, man, it was extremely tight. I've never had a grip frame uh, that's that tight fit. Uh, so, I mean, but I got it in there. So, uh, let me put the slide on it. Just put the slide on. There you go. 15 round magazine. So there you go. Wilson Combat uh, Grip Module Compact 15 round magazine. Okay. It's one of my favorite uh, weapon lights. Old Light PL Mini. There you go. But uh, I like the feeling of it. Uh, oh man, I, the, it it's uh, it feels really good. It feels really good. I can't wait to shoot this. But yeah, this is definitely staying on here for a while. It feels really good. So I, if you're looking for a good frame, I definitely recommend the Wilson Combat Frame. This is the first one I've had, and it feels really good. I didn't expect it to feel that good. People were right when they say this thing feels good. So, there you go. Wilson Combat Compact 15-round frame. Thanks for watching.